Hey guys, my name is Kaylee, and something I'm really passionate about is sleeping. Because for one thing, it makes you it makes your day better if you wake up fully energized or if you wake up grumpy. Such as the picture on the first slide. Which one of these is you in the morning? Are you happy? Are you grumpy? Some people wake up and they wake up in a really good or bad mood, and some other people wake up and they want to start the day early and they want to go hang out with their friends and just live their life in a really good manner. And when you're sleeping, you can have dreams. Did you know when we can only dream about faces we've already seen, even if we don't actively remember them or not? And one of the things bad about sleeping is parasomnia, and it's a type of disorder that makes you do unnatural things despite you sleeping. And a lot of people commit crimes while they're sleeping, such as rape, murder, child molesting, writing bad checks, and sleep driving. I hope none of you guys do this while you're sleeping. And did you know that your sleeping position can define your personality, such as the six here, we have the fetal, the log, uriner, soldier, free faller, and starfish. And the fetal one, some people are gruff and they have open, but they have open and warm hearts. The log, they're social butterflies. And the uriner, they have perceived as open, but they're truly suspicious people and they don't like talking about people. I mean, two people. And the soldier, they're more reserved, quiet people. They don't like talking. And the free faller, they're fun and fantastic at parties. And starfish, they're excellent listeners. And what happens to you while you sleep? There are many things that happen to you while you sleep, but the three things that really caught my attention were that your brain recharges, your cells repair themselves, and your body releases important hormones. And the optimal amount of sleep, all people, and all people are different. All people are different ages, so they need different amount of sleep. Such as three, babies need 16 hours of sleep because they're just born, they're just coming into the world. People 3 to 12, they need 10 hours. Same with people that are ages 13, 18, they need 10 hours. 19 to 55, they need 8 hours. And over 65, they need 6 hours. What happens when you don't sleep? You don't want to look like this if you don't sleep. Most, when you don't sleep, it causes depression, causes your age, your skin to age, and also causes you to be very stressful and stressed out about things such as school, work, your job, and your home life. Another question that I wanted to ask you guys, do you think there should be room, there should be light in the room while you sleep? Of course not, because you don't want that to disturb your sleeping. In the ideal sleeping conditions, some people like it really hot, some people like it really cold. I personally like it really cold. If it's really hot, I, start, I wake up and I start sweating and it's just not a comfortable feeling. And do having electronic devices before you go to sleep mess up your sleep? I personally think it doesn't, but some people need to not have like light in their face like an hour or two before they go to sleep. And it's not healthy because it could cause you to gain weight, which I didn't know, but that's what I learned from this. And now it's time to say goodnight. That, now that you have all these new facts about sleep, turn off your electronic devices, set your room temperature, make sure there is no light in the room. And lastly, have sweet dreams.